the unmet needs in kidney cancer are, uh, there are two ways of looking at this. The first is to say that when I started doing kidney cancer, and I feel slightly old saying that, I do feel a bit older than I did, but that's inevitable. Um, but uh, I think we didn't have any treatments really. And I remember speaking to patients and saying, well, why are you bothering doing these scans if you're not giving me anything? And that was really quite a reasonable question. And we were giving, you know, interferon essentially. And then VEGF targeted therapies and then combinations and then immune checkpoints. And, and actually the five-year survival, I was looking at some of the five-year survival of the CABO Nevo data and not reached after about five years of follow-up in the good risk. We're getting about, you know, four years median survival intermediate risk and a bit shorter in the poorest patients, still some work to do in that group, but it's not bad, three years. And when you look back in time, and it was one year when I started doing this, that's a huge leap forward. So I think we should think about the unmet need, but we also need to pause for breath and say we've made a lot of progress. One of my concerns is we've really focused on two targets. We've focused on pd pd one with or check immune checkpoints, I'll include CSA4 in that if I may, uh, and VEGF. And they've really been very much our target. And you could argue that's still the case, even Belzutifan is the, the, the HIF alpha, which is part of that VEGF axis. And so we probably need to find the third group of drugs which are effective. I don't know what they are, that's the problem. So there's a need for there. The other piece I might need is we need to find some biomarkers. I keep talking about it, but we do. We haven't been as good as we could have been at that. Having said that, as I said before, we've had so many good drugs. There's a guy called Bill Kalin uh, who uh, won a Nobel Prize for HIF. You know, and he's saying we need more drugs and I was saying we need more biomarkers. He won a Nobel Prize, I'm sure he's right. Um, so, uh, but nevertheless, uh, I, I do think we need to do the, the, the biomarker exploratory piece. Um, and we're beginning making progress in that and I'd like to see more circulating biomarkers. Um, and, uh, and I'm actually quite excited about circulating biomarkers in kidney cancer. I know it's more difficult than bladder cancer and prostate cancer, but I think we can get there. Uh, and then uh, I do think we need to sort out this perioptive issue. Uh, there seems to be progress with pembrolizumab, uncertainty with some of the other trials. We've had a negative neoadjuvant study. I'd like to see more perioptive trials to see if we can downstage patients, maybe cure more of those patients. Um, so for me, those are the unmet needs in the, uh, in the medium term.